Hey you guys, this is Karmi the Capital Z, welcoming you to the audio commentary of the matchup between Happy vs Grubby right here on Terna Stand. As you can see, Happy just took out one of the burrows of Grubby and right now Grubby is doing the best he can to try to save himself and Happy just just exploiting that uh, spell known to be Frost Armor of that Lich. And he's also like... He's really doing well, I have to say. Really, really doing well. Grubby is continuously making these Kodo Beast again and again and trying to consume those units, but Happy seems to have been taken down each of them instead of this one, which already has consumed a fiend. Uh, make no mistake, Happy can see this Kodo Beast wherever this Kodo Beast goes. That means that even if Grubby is somewhere in a distant place, Happy will be knowing it until that fiend is inside that stomach. is not digested, I have to say. And once again, following it, st it's still just chasing it off. And both of these players are actually in a fast mood uh, because the Torn Shifter has Endurance Aura and the uh, Death Knight has this Unholy Aura. And oh my, it actually followed it all across that river, all around that river, to the first bridge, to the second bridge. And probably, oh my, it took it out. A very very good move there by Happy and borrowed it borrowing uh, speeds up the regeneration which is really really good and actually these two up statues are really doing a good job that blade master standing behind the army waiting for an opportunity to strike and oh boy and that's what it was waiting for took out the fiend which had gotten weak and now trying to take out a statue and that statue being frost armored with that lich <laughs> this is really really epic I have to say that frost armor use of frost armor by happy happy is playing quite standard the only difference would be that he's using that frost armor very very much and now trying try to take out that barracks grubby getting inside trying to take out the units and snare that fiend and right now right, not trying to take it out although he happy did use frost arm over it and grubby has to go back to the base if this barracks go down grubby will be in a very very bad position now happy trying to take it out and this probably will go down as oh it will it does not have any peons near it to repair and stuff oh my oh my dust drop is being dropped oh my it may go down it may go down no Oh my, that fiend's attack is actually following it. Oh my, how, how? How can it go so... Oh my. It it followed it so far away. <laughs> Grubby actually used wind walk. He has a boots of speed and used level 2 wind walk, which is equal to level 3 wind walk. And that fiend's attack actually followed it all across halfway of the map. And Grubby goes to the other side of, of the river and towards his army and try right now actually going towards Happy's base it seems dividing his army into two parts and charging in the f a few units behind Gr Happy's base and that how is this barracks still alive oh well it at least went down and Happy gets back to his base as he sees that his base is an in danger Grubby is stalking out inside outside it and the only the one only fact that happy actually found out that this voodoo log was dropped outside grubby's base and grubby did not have an extra voodoo log inside his base only that fact actually ex totally uh, made a uh, happy exploit the game over here he was actually j just uh, running after that grunt trying to take it out and he actually found out that this voodoo log is here and and right now taking this one out as well which leaves grubby with no voodoo log whatsoever oh oh wait he actually had a voodoo log inside the face when was that dropped oh never mind i have to say that it was the first one and that first voodoo log is really really useful two kodo beasts were ready once again but these kodo beasts are just being attacked attacked and targeted once again being targeted And happy training on the last troll, cleaning cleaning up the mess. Destroyer is ready from happy. 
two destroyers ready and the <laughs> this may very well be GG. Happy has been dominant the whole, whole game. Once again trying to go inside. The straw appearance being used over that blade master but but it managed to escape. Now going after the burrow. Happy really hates burrows. He just attacked burrows once again and again and right now this may be the final battle of this game. Happy uh, both both of the armies are just inside each other, attacking, <laughs> taking hits over one by one, and the Death Knight being targeted, Thorn Chief also being targeted. Death Knight where may had gone down, but used TP to get back to his base right on time. And this will be the only opening that Grebby would need, as this is the only opening that he might get, and he chooses to go to Creep over here. Would be a wise choice, but he probably won't get to level up. After creeping this, even after creeping this spot, he has three Kodo Beasts ready and a troll being draw made over here. Troll this late of the game, I wouldn't say that it's quite advisable. Although he doesn't have anything to take out destroyers, raiders would be better. With ensnare, of course. One troll really cannot do anything over here. Krabby <laughs> is in a very very bad position and now once again trying to take out that blade, uh, death knight oh my the straw is being uh, used and those units just targeting out each other ta taking hits taking hits grab is trying to take hits over the thorn chieftain as it's a quite big tank type hero and being and that destroy being ensnared being targeted out by grubby but just used death coil to save it but it did go down a fiend is inside <laughs> each of these Kodo bees uh, while this might go down and that fiend will come out yes and the other one will probably also will happy has been dominant throughout the game and this game will probably be going to happy I don't see any way by gr which grubby actually can win this and his units taking hit after hit one by one and one of his last units left and that thorn chieftain does has a portion of invulnerability but i don't see any way still don't see any way mm, grubby actually did not have a, a goal he started his production right now after he actually lost all of his army both of the heroes standing at the bridge beside the base as they cannot face this massive army they need some supporters one troll is out which people at my server say walks slower than a peon and attacks slower than a demolisher lol <laughs> anyways uh, now trying to take a hits over that death knight that may be the only thing he can do but that death knight has a portion of invulnerability and that oh my that blade master being targeted has a portion of invulnerability but probably will go down oh and use potion and put that potion all right in time now calling out peons to attack and grubby says gg well good game well played by both i have to say grubby doesn't seem to be uh, being at his game and uh, good day for undead well, hope you guys enjoyed it. Storm easy. Over and out.